on the 16th of January, about 10 5 p.m., the Medina police had a report that the Vela Ahmed Hussein Swale, 831, a member of the Tiger IPR, was shot in his private BMW vehicle. The victim was right to Pentecost Hospital around Medina, but was pronounced dead on arrival. We've done lots of investigations, and through the eyewitness, we have been able to come a long way. Unfortunately, I'm unable to provide the details of what we have done so that we don't compromise the investigation. We have gone far. In the course of these investigations, 13 suspects have been questioned. One is currently on remand, assisting us in our investigation. And these 13 people that we have questioned include Anas and Honorable Kennedy at Japan. Other leads are being followed. But let me use this opportunity to clarify something that is going around in the airwaves. That one of the main suspects in this case was arrested and granted bail by the Kotobabi police. What actually happened was that on the 20th of March, one of the informants that who has been helping us went to Kutubabi police station and informed somebody who had arrested somebody in the course of their patrols and was at Kutubabi police station that he had identified somebody who fitted the description of one of the suspects in Swale's murder case. So whilst this policeman was engaging with the informant, he had a call from the pub, Wembley pub near Kotobabi, that the guy who was identified was about to leave the scene. So this policeman right to the pub, called the patrol team that was somewhere else to come and assist. He also met another policeman who was on duty and they entered the pub. When they got there, they actually arrested this person and he started struggling with the policeman. Still waiting for the patrol team to arrive. Instead of the public, those who were at the pub coming to the aid of the policeman, they rather went to the aid of the person. This policeman, sensing that his life was in danger, allowed the person to go. It is not accurate that the person was arrested, sent to Kotobabi police station, and because he had links with somebody else, the person was granted bail. This is what actually happened. And in the course of investigation, let me add that we've had support from the general public. People are coming day and night with information so that together we can find the killer of Ahmed. So it is not true that a person was arrested and Kutubabi police collected money and just allowed the person to go. The suspect never got to the police station. And let me also add that those who know Kotobabi well, Wembley Park is a popular drinking bar noted to be patronized by misfrants and other drug users. So the policeman actually felt that his life was in danger and he was not armed. We have set up investigation team to look at the circumstances under which the information even got out that the police arrested the guy, sent him to Kutubabi police station, and he was granted bail. Assuming he was granted bail, that would have made our work easier because somebody would have stood surety for that person. Let me give you the assurance that the police hasn't gone to rest. Our officers are on the ground day and night working so that whoever is behind the murder of Swale will be brought to justice.